Okay, so this doesn't work with bottles of wine. This is only for the makeup gurus. This isn't for the drunks, <laughs> okay? This, this doesn't work. Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. My name is Melina. Welcome back to another episode of Why Not. Um, today we're gonna do things a little bit differently, but we're still gonna do it over a bottle of wine because why the fuck not? Um, I got a lot of information to share, a lot of knowledge to drop, and so we're all gonna do it as we drink, naturally. Okay, today I'm super excited because I'm talking about something that is near and dear to my heart. Um, a love of my life, if you will, and it's not my boyfriend and it's not wine. So that says a lot. <laughs> um, it's Amazon. That was intense. But that's how I feel. Amazon, I love Amazon. Amazon has actually changed my life. Uh, so I wanted to kind of show you guys everything that I've gotten from there recently or over the last few months that has um, been some of my favorite items, my favorite things to purchase. Um, share them with you just so, just in case you guys wanna buy them too, just in case you guys wanna be the shopping addicts that I am, I can help enable you. Uh, before we get started though, I want to go over what kind of wine I'm drinking. Uh, so this is a Cabernet, um, just like last time, but I will tell you, I already know it tastes better and it's already a lot better. That wine was a shit show. That, that one was a train wreck. Honestly, I knew I was making a, a poor choice when I bought it, but I was being cheap. As we've covered in the past, being cheap gets you nowhere, okay? Don't do it. Actually, it gets you somewhere sometimes. <laughs> I mean, hello. But anyways, actually this bottle of wine was referred to me by a friend and it was actually like maybe two hours ago. Um, she texted me, said, hey, you gotta try this bottle of wine. It's amazing. I just had it. Um, she said it's only $10 from Target. I actually just purchased it from a grocery store called Fields. It's a very bougie grocery store. So it's probably marked up a lot more than it was supposed to be. So I paid $15. I'm feeling very um, elite. Uh, I'm feeling very expensive tonight. I splurged. $15 bottle of wine. I don't know, does anybody else feel fancy? I feel fancy. <laughs> I trust her judgment, so I went and I got it, and let me tell you what, so far, so good. Fun fact about this wine, it was actually made by the Dave Matthews Band. So it's called The Dreaming Tree. This one's the cab. Oh shit, this light. Anyways, Dreaming Tree by the Dave Matthews Band. I don't listen to the Dave Matthews Band, but does that stop me? Does that stop me from feeling cool? No, I still feel great. I feel cool that I'm drinking this wine and I will continue to drink this wine. Um, I did a little bit of research, and by that I mean I Googled it for upwards of 20 seconds, and I did find out that there are multiple flavors of this wine. Um, there's a Chardonnay, which I absolutely want to try because I've been getting on the Chardonnay train, and I'll be giving that a whirl. All right, Amazon. Amazon, like a poor nickname. A poor nickname that I have been given over and over again. People refer to me as an Amazon all the time because I'm six feet tall. If you didn't notice, I'm always sitting, sitting down. I'm six feet tall. Yes, that's true. Take it, absorb it, sit with it, let it settle. I'm tall as hell. For some reason, people always want to refer to me as an Amazon, and I hate it. That is not cool. <laughs> not cool. But, you know, actually, I take that back because after watching the movie Wonder Woman and the Amazonian woman in there, wow, uh, first of all, yes. You know what? I take that back. You can call me an Amazonian woman. That is totally fine with me. <laughs> How bipolar am I? I'm not, I'm just drunk, cheers. <laughs> Since we're talking about wine, it's only right that we talk about all the wine accessories that I have gotten from Amazon. Um, pretty much all my wine stuff I've gotten from Amazon because it's easy, it gets delivered to my door. Let's just talk about this really quick. Two days, two days you can have anything you want to your door, because we have Prime, obviously. Um, and apparently Amazon now is coming, so you can have it within minutes, within moments. I can't wait for that day, but St. Louis doesn't have it yet. It is what it is. We're behind the times, but whatever. All right, let's first start with wine glasses. 
Um, if you've watched my other two videos, then you know that I've been drinking out of this wine glass every single time. Love this wine glass. I love the shape of it. To me, it's just so like, ugh, oh, I don't know. Great, rich, it just says rich. I'm not rich, but I can pretend to be rich. Uh, this comes in a set of two, two for $17, not bad. I mean, that's pretty effing cheap. But if you think that's cheap, then we got this wine glass. So this, love this too. Um, these are Pinot Noir glasses. I'm drinking a Cabernet, so I'm drinking out of here. That's why I haven't drank out of these yet in my videos because I've been drinking, um, I think I started with a Malbec and now I'm drinking a Cab. These are Pinot Noir glasses. This comes in a set of four uh, for $17. So, hello, this is even cheaper. Um, the funny thing about these, this feels more heavy duty than this, but this was more expensive than this. I don't know. I can't explain it, but I do know they're both great purchases and I love them both. Uh, next, we'll talk aerators. So again, if you watched my last video, I'll link it down below. Um, it's a little bit different video. Um, if you haven't seen me before, my last video was a bun tutorial. I do a lot of different buns in my hair. But while in it, I mentioned how I aerate all my wine. Or not all of it. I aerate. I drink a lot of cheap wine. Uh, so therefore, I aerate a lot of it because it makes it smoother. So this is what my aerator looks like. It comes in two different pieces. This is the holder. This is the aerator. Um, so the aerator itself, this uh, is $21. A little pricey, well worth it. You're gonna use it constantly. Um, but basically, let, let me just do it really quick for you. Uh, that's how it works. You're just basically sending air through the wine. Um, just aerating it, you know, in a nutshell. Um, like I said in my last video, wine has tannins in it. Tannins make things bitter. Things, by things I mean wine. Uh, tannins make wine bitter. And aerating it actually sends air through the wine and releases those tannins and makes your wine a lot less bitter. Um, I guess cheaper wine has more tannins, has more tannic acid. I don't, I, I can't get technical with this. Don't come for me. Don't come for me if I'm not explaining this right. I already went over this before. Brief synopsis, why I aerate my wine and why I do what I do. The next piece to end the whole kit and caboodle is my wine opener. I'm gonna be real honest with you guys, I broke this bitch. I broke it the other day, okay? Uh, I don't really know how I did it, but I did. Um, this is only $20, it's an electric wine opener. That's probably why I broke it, I don't know. It worked for us for a very long time. Actually, I used it on a cork that you weren't supposed to use it on and that that's my bad. Um, but in this package, it comes with the wine opener, it comes with the seal opener that kind of cuts the seal open and it also comes with um, a pour, I believe. But basically this, what you're supposed to do is you put it down on the cork you press the button. The button still works, but it just trust me, it doesn't work. And then as you as you put it on there, as you wait, then it's supposed to pull the cork up and in. It's actually super nifty, and I love opening wine bottles because of it. But recently, uh, I've been doing it manually, and it sucks, but I'm about to buy another one. But not in time for this video. So sometimes life is life, okay? So now that we covered the most important things, <laughs> let's move on. Uh, the next thing that I'm going to show you guys is my coffee grinder. So uh, I didn't realize how fun it was to grind coffee until I had a coffee grinder. Um, this little bad boy is only $15. Now you can't grind a ton at once. You kind of got to keep putting in beans and doing like cycles of grinding the beans. But if you're doing it for a Keurig and if you're grinding just a serving at a time or just a couple servings at a time, it's actually really nifty. Um, I love it. Uh, I mean, I'll grind a whole bag at once. It takes some time, but um, super cheap, super easy. You just stick your coffee in here, put the lid back on, press your button, press your button here, and then it just all grinds, and then you can just dump it in there. Super easy to clean. This thing comes out, put it under the sink, wash it, whatever, put it back in, voila. Oh, the smell, the smell of freshly ground coffee, you you can't, well, wine. 
uh, but you can't beat it. Okay, so this next item is another household item, but I am extremely excited about it um, because it's the Charmin toilet paper roll button from Amazon. So basically what this bad boy does is you pair this to your phone. Um, I believe it's Bluetooth, um, but you basically pair it with your phone um, and it syncs up with your Amazon account and it's for things like laundry detergent, that's the next one I'm gonna get, um, toilet paper, um, just little things like this that you always forget to buy at the store, at least we do. We never remember to buy toilet paper at the grocery store and I'm not exactly sure why, but we end up having to make an individual trip just to get some goddamn toilet paper and it's so irritating. Um, so we got this button and basically you put this button wherever you keep your toilet paper or just wherever it's handy and you'll remember it. And whenever you start to run out, you press it and it automatically orders for you. So you don't have to go on your phone, not the computer, nothing. You just press the button and it automatically sends toilet paper directly to your house, two days, Amazon Prime, holy shit. I, for one, I feel like I'm living my dream right now. Literally living the dream. Moving right along, um, the next thing, not so much household, but if you work out, you're gonna love these. Um, so obviously, everybody's hip with the whole Bluetooth headphones, but these are super cheap and they're super legit and they come in this nice little nifty case that you just throw in your gym bag. They're $34. They just wrap right around your ears like this, around here. And you can jam and run. Okay, that's weird. Okay, let's move on to one of my favorite things and that's this bodysuit. Yes, you can get clothes on Amazon, absolutely. You have to be careful though, because some stuff is really poor quality. I mean, I'm not gonna lie to you, this isn't that great a quality. I mean, this isn't gonna last me that long. But this bodysuit was $15, $15. And not only that, you can wear it off your shoulders a little bit. That's how I do it sometimes, wear it off your shoulders. It also has a very deep dip in the back. Um, I've worn this so many times, I mean, it can go with any outfit. For $15, you really can't beat it, and it comes in white. Um, it's it's just prime time. Let me show you the back of it, because the back is what's gonna sell you, okay? So this is the back. I mean, it's basically, it's backless, so, I mean, what more do you want me to say, but there she is. Staying on the apparel side of things, not only can you definitely get some cute clothes from Amazon and some cheap stuff at that, but you can also get super fun, um, like themed clothes or holiday related clothes. So, I mean, if you, I, I look on there, whenever we have something going on that we have to wear something specific to, like when you have something themed, um, Amazon probably has something for you. For instance, um, we had a ugly sweater party. I guess you could call it an ugly sweater party, um, but we all dressed up and this is a sweater that I got. So this bad boy, um, I wanna say this was like 25. Um, I'll put the correct total right here. Um, but I mean, still super cheap and legit. I mean, let's take a look at it one more time. I love this sweatshirt, love it. Um, and this isn't, I mean, there's so much more where this came from. They're, they have so many funny Christmas sweaters. Um, there's more even like sweater sweaters. If you're actually looking for a real ugly Christmas sweater, they've got those a lot, a lot of different crew necks. Um, Christmas morning, Matt and I wanted matching pajamas. Um, they've got so many pajamas on there for couples. But we got these uh, pajama pants. Uh, these were maybe like, I don't know. 20 bucks. We're both super tall. I mean, I'm six feet tall. He's like six four. These are long enough. So next thing on the list that makes all of this possible was my ring light. Um, I actually got my ring light from Amazon. Um, I did a lot of research on ring lights. Um, I know the pros use the Diva ring light. That's anywhere between two to 250, um, 200 to $250. And I just wasn't willing to spend that. Not right now anyways. Um, so I looked on Amazon, uh, looked through the reviews. That's another thing. If you're on Amazon, make sure you just read the reviews. Um, if you're wondering if something's good quality, 
um, if it's gonna last, uh, if it is what it shows it is. Because I mean, don't, don't get me wrong, you're gonna run into some stuff that's sketchy that you're not gonna wanna buy. But read the reviews because the reviews will tell you if it's okay or not. So I stumbled upon this ring light and this ring light was $95 and it's prime time. Like it is, it is so nice. If you are trying to start YouTube, just trying to take pictures for Instagram, anything. I would highly recommend uh, this Diva Light. This isn't a Diva Light. I would highly recommend this ring light. A right, little bit of change of pace here. Um, we're gonna go into, I guess you could call this wellness. Um, just kidding, let's not call it wellness. Um, but this is my diffuser, my oil diffuser. This little guy is amazing so you can diffuse all different kinds of oils in this um, you can do different kinds of settings where it changes colors like this um, I like to do this I love it but if I'm feeling some type of way if I'm feeling different moods like for instance uh, when I want to relax I'll probably change it to a blue um, but if I'm feeling like like on Halloween I would change it to a green so I just let it chill here if it was Halloween just because I thought it was fun uh, you know there's purple blue it's actually a lot brighter than what you're seeing but this the light doesn't make it easy um, this actually looks pretty good though um, and it, yeah it just goes on and off you put your oils in here and you diffuse the room it's got a really nice scent um, it's so relaxing it adds so much when you're trying to relax and if you have a diffuser then you obviously need your essential oils to go in it so this is the one pure essential oils there are so many different brands that you can get on Amazon but this is just one that I happen to go with this was about 15 bucks um, this comes with uh, six different um, oils so we got eucalyptus peppermint sweet orange lavender tea tree and lemongrass and personally I got it for the lavender because that's supposed to make you relax supposed to help put you to sleep I got it for the eucalyptus because that's supposed to help with getting sick and I used to get sick all the time and then I also got it for the sweet orange just for you know a little pick-me-up just to make you feel more awake and energized okay so the next one um, I have issues sleeping um, my sister has super bad issues sleeping um, I, if I think I have a bad, she's got it way worse. But um, recently I found that even melatonin, just taking melatonin, just doesn't seem to work for me. Until one of my best friends, Ashley, uh, she told me to try melatonin drops. And I was like, hmm, that's interesting, okay. So I went on Amazon, per usual, and I got myself some melatonin drops. So I don't know if you can see these. This does actually work. This. They aren't just doing this for shits and gigs, people. This actually works. So look at this. So this is the brand that I got. I don't think brand matters. Um, I think it's just get the melatonin drops in general because they're sublingual. Um, basically, you take this, you take a whole drop full, which is up to this line, if you can see that. And then you put, put it underneath your tongue you hold it there for 30 seconds and then after it's been sitting there for 30 seconds then you swallow it this shit will knock you out I'm not even kidding like I'm not kidding if you are having trouble sleeping I highly recommend at least giving this a try um, because I didn't know about this and this is definitely changed the game for me so that's it those are my Amazon favorites. We have covered everything that I absolutely love that I have gotten from Amazon. Um, I honestly can't express how much I love Amazon more. Like it's just so convenient. Um, I don't have to go buy this stuff at the store. It just gets delivered right to my door in two days. I mean, it doesn't really get anything better than that. And also I wanna stress that if you're ever looking for something, if you don't, something, anything random, a random anything, search it in Amazon first. Search it in Amazon, see how much it is, and I guarantee you can get it to your doorstep in two days. So once again, thank you so much for watching. Thanks for stopping by. Uh, please subscribe. I would love for you to see my videos as they come out. Join the squad. And yeah, I hope you have an amazing weekend. And cheers.
God, I've drank so much wine tonight. It's ridiculous. You keep kind of got to... Got too much wine running through my veins. <laughs>